Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today I am in New York, and I'm playing the mission story, The Job Interview. So let's get started. Three families. That's all it took. The Ingrams, the Carlisles, the Stuyvesants. Tell us everything about them. The ivory towers are about to fall. And when we're done... Let's cross that bridge when we get to it. Yeah, let's go cross that bridge when we get there. all that matter. There's an issue. Of issue? course there. Here's a tissue. Olivia's tracked the names mentioned by the issue. constant. Issue! And they're dead ends. How dead? Obituaries for all three have appeared online. Accidental death, heart failure, lung cancer. They're covering their tracks. Faster than I thought. A contingency plan of sorts. The Constant wasn't aware of it. Well, it seems they didn't tell him everything after all. Something this big will leave traces behind. The Constant says to follow the money. Milton Fitzpatrick. The investment bank. It's a key Providence asset. Which you worked for. The director of the New York branch is a Providence operative. It's our best bet as a way in. I'll tell the pilot to turn the plane around. Right, gentlemen. Here's what we've come up with. The partners are transitioning between identities. But everything is so recent, the Milton Fitzpatrick bank records will still be intact. We've confirmed that the partners have active accounts there. However, the bank's records are remotely updated on a frequent basis. We may only have hours before any leads that could get us the new identities of the partners are gone forever. The data we need can be obtained in two ways. The bank's data core can be accessed through the basement vault, but getting inside the vault could be challenging. Alternatively, bank director Athena Savalas, head of security Mateo Perez, and head of accounts Fabian Mann each carry a partial backup drive with the data. We'll need all three drives to get the full data. Now, we cannot risk the partners discovering the data breach. Eliminating the bank's director, Athena Savalas, would sever the last remaining Providence tie to the bank and keep our activities hidden. Okay, one more time. We break into the vault, extract the hard drive rack, and eliminate the director on the way out. We. You. Good luck, 47. He's got a mouse in his pocket. Mission active. And if you're not subscribed, why don't you go ahead and do that while you're waiting? Welcome to New York, 47. Welcome. The Milton Fitzpatrick Bank is open for business, but it seems there's some sort of investigation underway. Expect increased security. Of course, why not? Your target, Director Athena Savalas, can be found in her top floor office, overlooking the iconic Teller Hall. Head of security, Mateo Perez, is roaming between the vault area and the teller hall, talking to employees. And head of accounts, Fabian Mann, can be found on the investment banker floor and the top floor of the bank, driving the internal investigation. Remember, we need to secure the data from the bank's reinforced vault, or, alternatively, acquire three hard drives carried by the director and her two lieutenants, Man and Perez. Lieutenants. Good luck, 47. It's always sounds so weird. Did you see mm. I am. Why does it look weird? Is it just me? I don't know why. This just doesn't look that clear to me. I don't know why. It's freaking me out, man. All right. Anyways. Yeah, I had to redo it. You know why? 
while I was playing? Because I wasn't recording while I was playing it, like an idiot. Alright, this guy is here and I don't want to get frisked. So, we, we shall go around. Unfortunate, yes, indeed. I could go walk behind him or I could un just unlock this door, but you know, just I'm going to risk it for the biscuit and uh, I'm just going to walk behind him. Oh, it sounds squishy. All right. I don't want to get too close. All right. And here we are. There we go. All right. So I have to disguise myself. Wait here. I, I gotta I gotta go this way first. Hold on. I gotta do the whole backstory and everything. So you guys so you guys know. Oh, have we talked to everyone? Mission story no, revealing. I, I saw him go into the bathrooms. He's been there for ages. Ages. Okay. Doesn't sound prompt. Milton Fitzpatrick is holding a round of job interviews. Mm -hmm. The final applicant was last seen going into the bathrooms where he's been for some time. Nerves, maybe? He's got the spicy yeah, diarrhea. The of the doubt. Let me know when he comes out. Okay. He's spicy. Bye. It's not diarrhea. I'm just kidding. He's throwing up. It's coming out the other end. Just kidding. Hola. Brilliant man. Uh, oh. oh. Go ahead, throw up. Why today? Why today of all days? Did you have the gas station sushi again? That has to be it. Nope, that's not it. Throw up because I have a feeling if I do this while. Well, you're looking in the mirror that I'll end up getting caught. And I kind of want to do this silent assassin. You know what? Why not? Um, disguise myself. What? Why is somebody coming in? Are you kidding me? Really? Really? You know, I'm not happy about this. When I, when I played it the first time, when I wasn't recording, I did this perfectly. The guy was throwing up and I ended up uh, being silent assassin, but no, this is what happens. I cannot believe it. Anyways, approach reception. Got it, got it. All right, here we go. Here I am. Um, are. Yes. Feeling better, I hope. Yes. Should I let HR know you're ready for the final interview? Yes. I feel like a new man. I am a Wonderful. new man. Follow me, please. It's right down here. Better than the original. Let's see what this will lead you to. Nervous? Right. Don't worry. You'll do fine. Uh huh. Sure thing, bud. I don't know what it is about you guys, but whatever. Mr. Thomas, have a seat, please. All right. Ah, May Mr. you Thomas, say so. You. I'm Kevin, and this is Melissa. We're both with Melissa. HR, and we will be guiding you through this last test. It's important to stress that there's no pass or fail here. It's merely a standard personality test meant to gauge how you'll fit into our corporate culture. All right. If you're ready, let's kick this off, okay? I'm ready. Okay, so this is a very simple test. All you do is pick a card and tell us what you see there. Now, it's important to point out that there are no right or wrong answers here. It's just to give us a better impression of who you are on a psychological level. On a cellular level. Does that make sense? No. Yes, I'm ready. All right, Mr. Thomas, uh, let's proceed then. If the you will, Rorschach pick test. The card that most Rorschach, conjures whatever. Up the word opportunity. Hmm. The big bird in the background, opportunity, yes. This one. All right. Now look at it closely. Take a few moments, then tell me, do you see an animal or an object? Animal. I see. What kind of animal? A bird. A bird? An eagle, perhaps. An eagle. Very interesting. An eaglet? A forceful animal. Anything else? It's feeding on something. 
ass. On what? A carcass. The scene is reflected in a pool of blood flowing from the body. It's a vulture feeding on someone else's kill. That's very graphic, Mr. Thomas. Yes. Brutal, even. Right. Mm, very interesting observation, Mr. Thomas. Uh-huh. <sighs> Not what we expected, but, but that's perfectly fine. Let's take the next one, shall we? Pick any of the remaining cards that make you think of execution, please. Oh, execution. Couldn't be that it's me standing there with dual pistols. No. I'll pick this one. Good choice. Tell me, what is the first thing you see here? Just the very first thing that comes to mind. I see a figure in a large coat. Perspective skewed, as if I'm looking at him from the ground. He's got something in his hands. I, uh, go on. He's on. Dual firearms. Large caliber pistols. I see. What else do you see? He's just finished a job. Perfectly executed. And who is this man? It's me. me. Very, yes, very me, interesting, Mario. Mr. Thomas. Well, that's a very creative interpretation, Mr. Thomas. Uh, I think we've just got time for the last card. Please proceed. Uh, this last card should hopefully prosperity. Make you think of hmm. Prosperity. Uh, well, the only one left. Okay. That one. Oh, very good. Looks this like an interesting fat one. stacks. What do you see here? Take in the whole image, please, and in as much detail as possible, tell me what this reminds you of. Wealth. Hmm. Can you elaborate on that? I no. see a big pile of money earned performing questionable actions. And how do you feel about that? Bending the rules of the game? It's what I do. Very good, Mr. Thomas. Well, I have to say, that was very impressive, Mr. Thomas. Oh, thank you. With your cutthroat approach and killer instinct, I think you'll fit right in with Milton Fitzpatrick. The euphemisms you so, are really more, in your face here. Mr. Thomas, allow me to congratulate you. Thank you. When do I start? <laughs> well, aren't you an eager beaver? Well, Roll your eyes at me, lady. You tomorrow at eight. Welcome on board, Mr. Thomas. Oh, thank you. All right. I shall go this way. I'm pretty sure that I can just walk around now. And I'm going to, well, I would take care of the cameras like before, but uh, I have already ruined my silent assassin rating, so. All clear on second floor. Good. <laughs> good, good. All right, here we go. I shall go here. You go in here? Yeah, I can. Wait, what does that do? Is that an exit? Well, well. Can I go in here. You can't just go inside without an appointment, sir. Oh, okay. Sorry, Milton Fitzpatrick's Athena Savalas' office. I'm sorry, she is not available right now. Can I leave a message? Hmm? Yeah. That is Athena Savalas, billionaire banker, Providence Herald. Hey. Hey. All right, you know what? Oi, hey, calm down. Relax, relax. Squeeze me? Hey. Oi. Gotcha. Oh! Shut up. Wait. Ah! You know what? Mm, let's see. Can I get away with taking somebody else's disguise? Damn it. Wait, calm down, boys. All right, you know what? I'm going to hide real quick just to, you know, do things smooth over. Command! Anybody there? Nobody's there. 
I need a different disguise. Command, I have nothing to report from my current location. Over. Night, night. Um. What are you looking at? Huh? Oh, what? Uh, unnecessary. Yeah. Yeah, you should be. Oh, dang it. You made me miss. Where? Where is he? All right. Well, I need another disguise, to be honest. New disguise would be nice. <laughs> Get your head out of your ass. Indian man, head of accounts at this branch of Milton Fitzpatrick. Okay. You should have part of the backup data call on his person. You know, since how I am not silent SSN anymore, I shall. You didn't see anything. I'm going to. Uh, That's the first I got a hard ass, apparently. But I'm just going to go around killing everybody and doing what I need to do to live my best life. Command, please acknowledge. Come in, command. Some what? What's that? That is unfortunate. What is that noise? Second backup data disk is secured. Just secured. All right. So where's he at? Downstairs. I wonder if I can get away with killing everybody. I wonder. Where's this douche canoe at? Find anything yet? No, but I'm not even sure. Uh, I think he's downstairs. Maybe. I got two out of the three discs. I think he might be downstairs. Let's uh, figure it out. Hey, big B. Maybe. If not, I'll just take uh, the one out of the vault. Easy, I guess. And how are you today, sir? Mm, could be better. Sir, sir, this is the vault. The, way you came. the data core should Might be behind that large steel door. I'm glad we speak the same Drop the gun. Find them. Oh shoot! Quiet now. Quiet. Man down. Oh God. Oh God. Mm. Uh, looking for backup. Mm, hush now. I need backup. What? Oh, where, where are you going? Where are you going? I'm right here. Ah, oh, dang it. Well, guys, I'm going to leave this episode here. If you like this episode, please leave it a like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!